this morning on our series, Man Up, Makeovers for Dad. Well, you're about to meet a father who has two lovely children, a beautiful wife, and an extended family of 53. Whoa. In its heyday, Flint, Michigan was home to more than 80,000 auto workers. Then factories closed, turning this once bustling boom town into a bust. Come on, Dominique, gotta get down, man. Someone was there to pick up the pieces. Watch where you're standing, man. In 1997, Sam Wells started the Alpha Esquires, a community group emphasizing education first, civic responsibility, and character building. Come on, straight. A chance for young black men to reach beyond the mean streets of Flint. Hey, he's in the house! The boys perform around Flint to raise scholarship money by stepping. That's a confidence builder when, when you hear people calling your name and clapping and applauding. All right, Travis! They stand up, speak up, hold their heads up, carry themselves with a, a lot of confidence. Now 53 strong, their success is measured not just in their rhythm, but in education, boasting a 90% high school graduation rate. Amir McCullough attends Eastern Michigan University. Um, he saw me and he saw my potential and he just saw me as one of his, his sons. Everybody got the gum out? But there's something the boys think Sam needs help with, his look. Hey, hey, hey. hey. <laughs> is, that, is, this, is that Versace? <laughs> Joining us now are Sam's wife, Faye, and our dad makeover team, style expert Greta Monahan and grooming guru, Kyan Douglas. Good morning to everybody. Hey Thank you all for being here. <laughs> Faye, Faye, the kids love him. <laughs> but what do you think about his style? He has good taste. Um, he does have a problem being having the colors, yeah. uh, a little bit colorblind. Yeah. So he relies on his daughter. So you were lying to me about the whole style thing. <laughs> All right, let's see the before and after because we want to bring him out here and see exactly how great he now looks with the help of our team. So you, uh, you've got the before right there, and now let's bring in the after. Come on out, uh, Dad. Come on out here. Where are you? He's Ready? in the crowd somewhere. Where, where is he? Yeah, get a little kiss there. Oh, that rounds out the outfit. <laughs> Looking good. How do you feel? You like you like the look? Love the look. You look great. I love the look. You look great. They, they took some years off. <laughs> <laughs> nice job, Greta. Let's uh, let's start with you. What did we do? Okay, well we went shopping at Macy's, and Faye was right. Yeah. Actually, most men have a, are colorblind, yeah. so don't hold that against them. Just help them. What we did was we wanted to pop some color. He lives in a lot. He has a lot of black suits, and we said let's get rid of that because he's hanging around with young guys. He's going to the Denzel, rock the Denzel, Washington look. Works for him. So we did the lavender, which is great on everybody. We did the little trench coat that's lightweight yep. and gray and even did the dark jean but it's like a gray black and that will go anywhere yeah. he can do his mentoring he can talk he can teach he can be with them casually he doesn't respect. have to worry about it Kyle oh and show him the bag che, when, when, what do you think of that so he can go and have his favorite <laughs> So he's like a master at grooming already. He teaches kids actually how to groom. We went yep. to B, uh, B. Braxton. It's an upscale grooming parlor in Harlem. He got a haircut. He got a shave. He got a manicure. He um, he also got his teeth uh, whitened. Nice. Right. The only thing that was really missing from his routine was skin care. Because he gets uh, razor burn, he needs to be using a skin care regimen that has salicylic acid in it. So we're going to send him home with some DDF, which has salicylic acid. For anybody watching at home that gets razor burn, Razor burn. You got Find it. a skincare That's line great. that has okay. salicylic acid. Great job, Kind. Thank you so much, Greta. Thank you, Faye. Great to see you as well.